And then I like kept lasering as I fell down <laughs> to die. And I'm like, because it, it buffered the laser, right? And it, I couldn't like di, like you know, like move in with the laser. So we had Xerxes on versus. So this Jantus. is what I was waiting for. I want to see the meat now. The meat mountain brings the hype. I, I just expected him to wave land across the platform. Can you beat Xerxes on Gandorf in melee? Yeah. In a ditto? Uh, in a ditto? Maybe. I wouldn't, I wouldn't like, count on it, but it's possible. Oh, good recovery. Crazy. Good recovery by Xerxes on. So it looks like, it looks like Rob is able to up B and like, but oh, save down to Do an aerial, then save it for later. Which was one I think which wasn't possible in Brawl, if I'm not if I was not mistaken. Wait, wh what did you say he can do? He can uh, up B, do an aerial, then do uh, keep up being like using the booster. Oh, can he do that? That's I think so. Oh, that was a hard read, and he didn't die. I can't believe it. No, dude, Ganondorf kind of like that's why I'm not. Can you not tag? <laughs> stage spike with the salad toss. The salad toss. <laughs> salad toss too good, dude. Can you, can you tech the stage in this game? Is it just a tighter you window? Can. It seems like teching has a tighter window in this game. I'm not I could be wrong. I feel like... I don't know. Okay. I play a lot of For Glory and no one techs there. <laughs> well, I think it's just because For Glory people are bad. That's true. I mean, if they let me get like 70% win rate, they're probably bad. Yeah. Dude, he's getting up! He's, he's tossing, tossing the salad! The <laughs> that sounds sexual. Oh, the air forward. Oh, dang, it didn't kill. I'm disappointed. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, dude, this is looking bad. Dude, I, he, that's that's game, dude. Are we thinking? I was, I was expecting him to down B and get his double jump back. <laughs> it doesn't work as much for dude. That's I tried with Falcon. The first first like like ten minutes of me getting Smash Four for 3DS, I play Falcon, and I like the knee has the most lag. Fifty of any like move. frames of ending lag. That's so bad. And like I'm like playing online with Rustin, and I'm trying to. We're trying. I'm trying to dash dance. He's trying to shield. He's like shield dropping, <laughs> and then we're like, dude, let's just like hang out tomorrow and play melee. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dude, that's it. I like or that. Something. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. I, I feel like we have like a really weird mentality about it, but yeah. I, I really like. I, I, I'm beginning to really like Smash Four. I think. I think that Roy's down smash has like 80 frames of lag. It's pretty good. <laughs> Dude, I think so too. Roy, Roy is basically a Smash 4 character. No, dude, you get the rubber chicken hitbox too, like you <laughs> do in Smash 4. <laughs> and they're like not in hit stun at all. So I, not I think Xerxion counterpicked Battlefield to uh, oh, to kind of a t small stage, got some platforms. Yeah. Oh, I think it's Dang, there's so much lag on that. I'm not quite sure if because it feels like Jam and Toast can like cover most of the platform with his uh, salad toss. Yeah, the salad toss is so good. Oh, he got him with the Sparta kick. Yeah, dude. Oh, I love Ganon's the boots. Boots great. Moves are so bad. I think he, can, he tried to shield pressure him with the top. Yeah. <laughs> trying to limit his recovery options off stage. I think like a lot of casual players really. I think. My friend told me, like, as a casual player, he really enjoys playing Smash 4 because you have the option, like, they never get the option to go so deep off stage to kill something. Oh, yeah. Because it's it's hard to judge the risk versus reward in a game like Melee, you know? Unless you're Jigglypuff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah. But no, one wants, no one's that late. Except... Prince. <laughs> <laughs> Shots. Just air dodged off stage. I feel like Rob has huge hitboxes actually. I feel like people oh, are Oh dang, he went deep for that. Oh my oh, god, no. oh, nice tech. Oh! He's going for oh. the. So, in dang. case you didn't know, uh, I think most people do know this, but if you you only get invincibility on the first ledge re grab, and if you grab the ledge while they grab the ledge, you steal the ledge from them, but it forces them into a jump animation. So, a lot of Falcon mains will try to uh, like steal the ledge from. Wait for someone to grab the ledge, they steal the ledge, then they ledge hop, dare them to kill them. Oh dang, that's sick. It's kind of a... S but I don't feel like grabbing ledge is like that good of an option Smash 4. Like, going off stage is like almost always what you want to do. Unless you're like, bad. Oh! Oh nice. my god, great conversion from uh, Xerxion. Right there. He's got quite a deficit here though. He's looking... 
every looking rough. percent matters, and when like a hard read leads to like twenty percent, I feel like it's pretty hard to. Uh, like, you, know, you have to, yeah, you have to read them like five times. Especially with Ganon too, though. Ganon has like so few options in Smash Four. <gasps> oh no! Does he still have the suicide side B? I don't think so. Oh, well, nice. I, th I think He's he does. In. But the thing is, like, oh, he he grabbed the top. Oh my god. The thing in like, Smash 4 with like suicide stuff is that they recently buffed it, sorry, patched it, so that if you your Bowser you Bowser side someone, you oh. lose. Oh, that's it. Oh, Janitos takes it from Xerxion. Props to Xerxion for sticking through with Ganon. 